Hi, my name is Dana Henry and I'm a family nurse practitioner student at Texas State University. I would like to discuss with you a pilot study that was conducted this past fall 2015 semester. And um, just to give you a little background on what we're going to discuss, uh, we know that antibiotic resistance is one of the world's most pressing public health concerns and that this is partially due to the overuse and misuse of antibiotics. Uh, I was part of a research group comprised of four research teams who each sought to answer specific research questions. And we all found in the review of literature that antibiotics are the most frequently prescribed medications for children. We also found that this is mostly for um, viral acute respiratory tract infections with only about 27% of the acute respiratory tract infections being bacterial in nature. We conducted a non-experimental descriptive survey to determine the clinical strategies of healthcare providers to reduce antibiotic overuse for pediatric acute respiratory tract infection patients. And our research team's uh, specific research questions were what screening or diagnostic testing do APRNs employ at point of care for patients suspected of having acute respiratory tract infections? And how often are antibiotic contingency plans chosen as a treatment strategy for acute respiratory tract infections? We obtained IRB approval for this study and created a 35 item multiple choice questionnaire with open comment dialogue boxes. And the, the items for this questionnaire were created based on evidence-based national guidelines. Uh, we also used an expert panel of practicing advanced practice nurses and educators to establish a scale content validity index of 0 0.90 for our tool. A formative evaluation was then undertaken by field testing the paper form of our questionnaire using a Think Aloud protocol um, with 10 participants. Two of the participants were phys physicians and eight were nurse practitioners, all practicing uh, with a large population of pediatric patients. Um, six of the uh, items in the questionnaire were specifically addressing uh, our research questions regarding testing and contingency plans, and we found that contingency plans were rarely used and that providers may overuse antibiotics based on clinical presentation alone. Um, because we conducted a small pilot study, we believe that the next step should be to use our valid tool, the questionnaire, to conduct a larger study with a larger sample size um, to better understand advanced practice registered nurses' clinical practice strategies uh, to deter antibiotic overuse. We believe that antibiotic um, resistance can be combated by uh, nurse practitioners by utilizing the national guidelines for antibiotic prescribing and by embracing antibiotic stewardship. And two ways we may be able to make a positive impact on this problem is by um, having healthcare provider protocols for contingency plans that could be disseminated nationally and also by um, providing public education campaigns um, that focus on testing and contingency plans to improve the parents' understanding of antibiotic overuse. Thank you.